Hey, United and friends, good to see you today. For our two minutes of two, I have a special guest with me. Her name is Natalia, my youngest daughter, and she's going to be helping us um, to read a part of the Bible together. Uh, and we want to check out a specific word that Jesus used to describe himself and other followers talk about to describe him as well, and that's light. John uh, talks about the light of the world coming and overcoming darkness. Jesus says, I'm the light of the world. But what's really cool is when Jesus not only says that he's the light of the world, but that we are too. So Tally, why don't you read the verse where it says that to us? You are the light of the world. A city set on a hill cannot be hidden, nor do people light a lamp and put it under a basket, but on a stand, and it gives light to all in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others so that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father who is in heaven. Awesome job, Tally. Where's that from? Matthew five fourteen through 16. Cool. Yeah, that's a great verse because I love how Jesus calls us to be a light as well. And it's a great opportunity that we have. And it says there, our good deeds help show the light of Jesus in this world. And I want to encourage you to be full of good deeds right now. And we have three cool opportunities that we can direct you to if you are coming up shy for ideas. Uh, and there are three things that are happening Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Two of them are food distribution um, opportunities at Owings Mills High School with some of our community partners there uh, and they happen from 10 to 1 Wednesday and Friday and then on Thursdays we're going to be heading downtown to Hopkins a uh, certain warehouse where we're going to be working on PPE personal protection equipment uh, for our first responders and medical professionals who need face masks sanitizer so forth and we're going to be putting that together and assembling that on Thursday nights from 5 to 9 we'd love for you to join us at either of those opportunities. You can get more information at the link below to sign up and learn more about that. But let's be a light in this dark time as Jesus is the light of the world, overcoming darkness, so can we. Thanks.